Governors in the 19 northern states of the country are set to meet next month to assess the progress in the fight against polio in the region. The northern states are reported to have the highest cases of polio in the country. The chairman of the Northern Governors Forum, Dr. Mazu Aliu, made the revelation as he donated five cars and 50 motorcycles to the National Primary Health Care Development Agency in support of the immunization and polio eradication program. The plan to eradicate polio encountered initial challenges in the northern part of the country and that aided the rise of a disease within the region. For instance, in 2009, there was a 900% increase in polio cases in northern Nigeria. That's according to the World Health Organization. But the involvement of traditional and religious leaders relaxed the initial restraints of the people towards the vaccines. For the benefit of Niger Light. One of such interventions is this one by the Niger State Governor, Dr. Babangida Liu. He also made available an additional 22 million naira for the purchase of vehicles for the immunization exercise in the state. We must continue with this exercise. We are very happy that the international organization and donor agencies are helping us. The January 19, 2012 meeting of a Northern Governors Forum, which will be chaired by the Niger State Governor, would hold in Kaduna. Those in the forefront of eradicating the disease believe that the government is on course to turn around the situation within the region. I want to use this medium to call on police and Ministry of Justice to make sure the child right law is implemented because it is through this child uh, right law, Primary Health Care Development Agency, is established and we want to thank governor once again he has been cooperating with us supporting us in this effort in fact we have been told of your efforts by providing us vehicles and motorcycles which we are going to share to the local government no doubt the fight against polio in united states got a boost with these donations and it is expected that the difficulties experienced by the immunization officers in the state will be reduced, thereby giving polio the final kick out of the state.